in there. It's a nice one. How's it going today, everyone? Creek Crawler here. I am in Southern Ohio and a little creek and my prior video, we kind of found some smallmouth spawning activity in the creeks that I was fishing. So we're gonna go look for smallmouth that are on beds, possibly in that spawning mode. See if we can't get some cool underwater camera footage of some spawning behavior. We're also gonna go hit the river, hit the Great Miami River, do some bank fishing around the river, see if there's any smallies that are spawning in there or getting ready to spawn. Cause they're getting really close to shore and they're really looking for places to put their beds. So we're gonna do some creek fishing for smallmouth in the creek and we're also going to take a take a pit stop or two down at the river to see what we can come up with so stay tuned for the action let's see if we can't catch some fish today guys let's go all right let's go over a couple of the things i'll be carrying with me today in the creeks and the rivers got my daiwa tatula elite 100 hsl spooled up in 12 pound fluorocarbon got the little uh, mega bass spark shad on there with a 3 16th jig head awesome combo got the light jig texas daiwa kage rod Awesome little swim bait, little baits. I'll also put the leech on it too when we go to the river or when whatever we're going to the creek. I'll kind of swap in between the two because I'm still trying to get familiar with the bait casting platform. And with the spinning gear, got my 2500 Daiwa Kage 10 pound Power Pro Super Slick Braid with the Daiwa Kage spinning rod, the jerk bait tube 610 medium extra fast action. That's the uh, Nico leech. This is the Magma leech. I'll also be throwing Helger mites and stuff like that see what we can get into today and that's just on a little owner ewg football finesse jig head i got my gopro here that i'll be putting underwater this is a gopro hero 8 black that i'll be getting my underwater footage with today we'll set this off the nest a little bit try not to make the fish too suspicious but yeah we'll put this underwater and hopefully get some sweet footage with it today I just watched him come up and smoke that thing. That was freaking awesome. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> They're not all spawning. They're all cruising around. This leech, man, I tell you what, this magma has just been doing so much cool stuff for me lately. Dang, dude. And that right there is an awesome creek smallie. Yeah, I threw it upstream about, I don't know, maybe five yards and just let it sit there and kind of drift it and just like slowly dragged it. And just let it sit there. And he took a peek at it and came over and just munched it. There you go, buddy. I see a giant koi. I think it's a koi. That'd be so cool to hook into him. That is a huge koi fish. Got him. Y'all, no freaking way did I just do this. You just hit the leech. It's a huge koi. I think. In the creek, what? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen in a creek. I guess somebody might have left their, I don't know, taken their pet and put it in the creek. This is crazy. Look at it. Come on, buddy. Let's land you over here, actually. Geez, he's fighting like a freaking monster. Y'all, I've never seen something like this in a creek in my life. Pretty sure that's a koi. What? 
He ate that leech whole. Unbelievable. Look at this thing. That's crazy. No freaking way. Look, it's in the mouth too. All right, we're gonna get a release on this guy. Choke the magma, look, it's in his mouth. That's crazy. This is the coolest thing I've ever caught in a creek. All right, right there on the magma leech. That's insane. I still can't get over this catch. Get a closer look. Look at that. This guy's little barbels. 100% a koi down here in the creek. He's living his best life. Let's get a release on him. He is pretty easy to spot. I think he's ready to go. That is so cool, man. There you go, buddy. <laughs> as soon as he seen that leech, he beelined and ate it. I'm like speechless. Completely speechless. Wow. All right, I think I see a bed with a smallie on it. We'll see what kind of engagement we can get out of them. All right, we put the underwater camera down there. Hopefully it doesn't spook him off. We'll see if we can't get an underwater bite on camera today. The beds have been few and far between I found a couple with some males on them, but not too many. Let's come back around. Got him. <laughs> that was awesome. We got that underwater eat on camera too, I think. Oh, he's decent. That's 12 incher. Eh, maybe 11. We got that eat under cam on the camera, I think, underwater. A little chunker. Doing good out there, buddy. There you go. Well, that was pretty cool. We got the underwater eat on camera. Plain as day, you could see it. That was awesome. Let's keep it going and see what else we can catch today. All right, I just found a, a larger bed with a larger fish on it. So we're gonna put the underwater camera and see if we can't get the bite on, um, can't get the bite underwater. All right, we got the camera in place. I'm gonna wait for that fish to come back. Get it in there. 
Got him. It's a nice one. I think I got that eat on camera too. Come here, buddy. Oh, that is a nice, nice creek smallie. Yes. Yes. I think I got that eat underwater. This has been insane. That's a 15 and a half, 16 incher. Look at that though. That penetration in the side of the jaw. There we go. Got him out. Let's go get an underwater release since the camera's already over there. All right, that's our second fish on a bed today. And we've got a couple out just swimming around too. So we'll keep it going and see what we can get into. So what I'm doing is just kind of wading in the water in the middle of the creek and just kind of looking at the banks, looking at the cover, looking at the spots where I would expect a smallmouth bed to be. And then I'll kind of get a closer look and see if they're there or not. But yeah, I'm just kind of just like slowly walking through the creek. Ooh, there's a fish right there. And seeing if there's any beds. <laughs> right in front of me that was awesome it's a chunker chill buddy all right i get it i get it get my leech back all right there we go it's a nice little chunk look how fat there you go buddy It's a good fish too. Hey buddy. Let's freaking go. I'm smoking them today. Oh, chill out, chill, 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 chill. Oh yeah. That's a nice fish. Look at that. Came out from under those big boulders over there and just hammered the leech. That's a 14. Probably 14 and a half. Chunky. Here you go, buddy. Nice. Something's going on back here. There's some smallies, it looks like. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I just broke off on a freaking giant. No, he took my leader. Oh, that's a good fish too. All right, buddy. Oh, there's one following him. Oh, that's a really good fish. Oh, he's got the cool black dots on him. Oh, there we go. Look, he's got cool black dots on him. Melanistic, I believe. They are smoking this magma leech. Absolutely crushing it. That's cool, man. I like those black dots. That's a 14 and a half incher. That's a nice, nice freaking creek smallie. After I just lost one, that's awesome. Here you go, Bob. We're gonna make a quick pit stop down at the river see if there's any smallies doing some spawning behavior. Looks kind of muddy, but if you throw it in the pockets where you think there's a bed, sometimes you'll get bit. So we'll give it a shot down here for a little bit. Might go back to the creek afterwards.
Oh, don't. It's a big fish. Big fish. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Chill out, buddy. Chill out. Oh my gosh. Look at that fish. Oh my gosh. Let's go put him on the measuring board, see what he is. All right, we got an 18 incher on the nose. Freaking tank. Pretty sure it was on a bed, but I couldn't see it. The water's really murky down here on the river, but I was just slowly dragging that leech and he almost took the rod out of my hands. That was awesome. All right, let's get a release on my first Fish Ohio Smalley of the year. What a tank, 18 on the nose. Look at that fish. There you go, buddy. Let's go. There you go. Oh my goodness, that's a huge rock bass. That might be a fish Ohio. Jeez. Biggin. We just got a nine inch rock bass. That makes master angler. That's not even May yet. Got smallmouth, rock bass, saw guy, and sunfish. When the ice is on the lake. What a chunky one. There you go, buddy. Look at the colors. They're beautiful. There you go, bub. Got a nice saw guy. Bub. There we go. Freaking choked it. Look at that. It's not what we're after, but oh, he's gonna bite me. Is it that easy? Oh, nice. Check that out. That's cool. Really dark. Just smoke that swim bait along the bottom. It's like an 18, 19 incher. And probably 18. It's not our target species, but I'll take a saw guy any day of the week. Here you go, buddy. All right, everyone, we're going to end the video. But holy smokes, was this day phenomenal. Got an 18 inch smallmouth in the river, a nine inch rock bass in the river, completed my master angler before May, caught a bunch of fish on beds, did some awesome work here in the creek with the magma leech. It was a pretty phenomenal day if you ask me. Um, you can't ask for much more than that. Some big fish, skinny water, some bed fishing, underwater bites, a huge koi on a Nico leech. <laughs> <laughs> that was insane that koi engulfed that leech i casted it out just hammered it and put up an awesome fight that's pretty unique i've never caught a koi fish before if you have uh please comment down below if you've ever caught a koi out in the wild this is a creek a tributary to the gmr and it was just hanging out in here just like hanging out with the carp it was it was an awesome day if you'd like to get some waterlands use code crawler 15 on their website save 15 percent off anything on their website if you'd like to get some nico leeches on the nico fishing website you can use code crawler 10 get 10 percent off all your nico stuff all your nico baits leeches crawls winnows your super neds anything off the website vance outdoors probably still has some of the magma leeches either in obets hebron or lebanon you'd have to call around and ask and see if they still have them i know it's a limited edition run for nico but this color has been absolutely killing it for me this year and had an awesome time in the creek so if you enjoyed the video hit the like button down below subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys out in the water let's go